friends, this video review is for Starting Over by Nance Sparks. If you want to check out my review, I have just posted that. So if you're on YouTube, there's a link in the description below. And if you're on my blog, there's a link within the post. And this is the video review. So, Starting Over by Nance Sparks. Um, this was a reminder um, that kindness is where you least expect it. And I absolutely love that. Um, Jennifer takes a job in uh, Minnesota after um, this wildfire meant that she had to evacuate her home again for how many she's been through. Um, she meets Sam when she arrives, a woman whose life um, hasn't been the same since the death of her wife. And uh, issues at work start to threaten to destroy Sam's career and it's up to Jennifer and um, the job she was hired for and uh, to use her skills um, to prove that this had nothing to do with Sam and anything to do with the security issues and scandal that they're both now being exposed to. Um, had nothing to do with either of them. So I loved every second of this. Um, it dealt with a lot. There was there were really important emotional issues um, and it cemented that one important thing. Um, when someone truly loves you, they'll stop at nothing to help you through whatever you're going through. Um, Sam and Jennifer, they have this instant connection from the moment they met. Um, Sam was kind of hesitant, which was completely understandable. Um, exploring things outside of her comfort zone wasn't in her plans. Um, but she just couldn't really resist Jennifer. Um, their working environment was very much the lead to getting them to know one another better. Um, there were some very relatable events in that um, initial meeting after their very first meeting. Um, and uh, Jennifer got to, um, got to Sam to help her to open up and, and, and explain what she was going through and, and accept some help. So I admired the way Jennifer handled every situation. She took extra care to try and understand and, and, and she didn't want to apply any pressure to Sam. She wanted to just understand her needs and then help her. So that was really, really lovely. Um, she didn't apply pressure or anything to the situation. She just went with it and tried some things and was encouraging and supportive. Early in the story, I really loved both Sam and Jennifer. Just the way they, um, they spend relaxed time with one another and slowly helping you know Sam to move forward it, it was really baby steps it was so lovely um, it was just a natural feeling situation and then the story took this unexpected turn and issues threatening Sam's career were revealed and then a little bit of excitement and tension built because you just didn't know um, whether you know Jennifer was putting a lot of trust in Sam but did she really know her and there was all that worry that maybe she didn't um, but she was really, you know, she was really determined to prove that Sam wasn't what she was being accused of being. So it was a great addition to the storyline. It had my heart breaking for them both in those moments because I really worried about them. Um, there were no guarantees they'd come out of the situation without any complications. It could have ruined everything. Um, but I just loved the story so much and I can't recommend it enough. It was fantastic and I really, really enjoyed it. It's the first story I've read by Nance Sparks and it won't be my last. Um, it was really exciting and I really hope you'll enjoy it. So I'll put a link in the description so you can grab a copy of Starting Over by Nance Sparks, which I hope you will. If you've read Starting Over, I'd love to know what you thought of it, so please do comment. It's great to find out what you thought of the story. And if you haven't read it yet but you're planning to read it, it's on your pre-read list. Being now super excited and thinking, yes, I really want to read that. And again, please do comment and let us know because it's always great to find out what you're interested in reading. And if you do read it, I hope you have the best time. It is the loveliest story. Bye.